Six-zero-one-seventy. Ready to arm. What are the six basic instruments on an aircraft? The pilot can quickly check the six pack to get the most recent data on the speed, altitude, climb, descent, attitude, heading, and turning banking of the aircraft. The six individual pack's instruments are airspeed indicator, altimeter, vertical speed indicator, attitude indicator. Heading indicator, turn coordinator. Several aircraft systems provide electricity to the six instruments. The pitot-static system, which delivers ram air pressure from the pitot tube and ambient pressure from the static port, is used by the ASI, altimeter, and VSI. All three instruments use the static port. However, only the ASI makes use of the pitot tube. The internal euro of the gyroscopic instruments AI, HI. And turn indication is powered by vacuum, pressure, or electricity. The ASI measures and displays the aircraft speed using the pressure differential in the pitot static system. The ASI in the majority of aircraft shows speed in knots or miles per hour. The aircraft's current indicated airspeed is represented by a needle (IAS). Standard color-coded markings offer stall, flap setting, normal operation, caution, and never exceed speeds, among other important speed information for that model of aircraft. The meanings of the colors of an airspeed indicator are listed on the picture. Attitude indicator. The attitude indicator, also referred to as the artificial horizon, displays the aircraft's attitude with respect to the horizon using an internal euro that is permanently affixed. The show consists of a small plane flying straight and level toward the horizon, with a blue sky above and brown or black ground below. The horizon is crossed by a vertical scale that displays the degrees of pitch up or down. The top of the scale is curved and indicates the amount of bank left or right. The airplane essentially rotates around the AI zero when changing pitch or direction, and the instrument display reacts accordingly. Altimeter. The altimeter uses barometric pressure obtained from the static port to display the aircraft's approximate altitude or height above mean sea level (MSL) in feet. Three pointers provide the altitude information in 100, 1,000, and 10,000 foot increments. Because barometric pressure changes with altitude and atmospheric conditions, most altimeters contain an adjustment knob to dial in the local barometric pressure, also known as the altimeter barometric setting. Turn coordinator. Both the initial roll rate and the stabilized rate of turn are displayed by the turn coordinator using a canted internal euro. When an aircraft is spinning at the typical rate of 3 degrees per second, an aircraft silhouette that replicates the aircraft will line with a mark on the display. Keep in mind that the turn coordinator only indicates turn rate and direction, a bank angle is not intended. A liquid-filled inclinometer that measures slip or skid may be part of the turn coordinator. Heading Indicator, HI The heading or current compass rising direction of the aircraft is shown on the HI by means of a revolving euro. The HI displays headings in 5-degree increments, with every 30 degrees enumerated, using a 360-degree compass card with north represented as 0 or N. The last zero of the heading is deleted to prevent crowding, 3 is 30 degrees, 12 is 120, etc. The internal HI compass card is turned by an adjustment knob to line up with the magnetic compass of the airplane. Vertical Speed Indicator, VSI The VSI uses internal pressure differential to provide a visual indication of how fast the aircraft is climbing or descending. A diaphragm with chambers connected to the static port expands or contracts in response to climbs and descents, causing the instrument to indicate the rate of climb or descent in hundreds of feet per minute FPM. A hole in the diaphragm releases the pressure change to return to zero rate when no change is occurring. Heading 360, uh, 170, ready to arm.